is up gamers today we're going to be opening up the mark 85 marvel legend from the uh the bro thor build a figure so let's take a look at this it's looking nice the package is looking nice it's come with some accessories a lot of accessories uh and then we got a uh a little image of <clears throat> iron man uh from infinity war his nanotech suit on the back we got Look at the wave. We're going to be opening up Iron Man, and we've already opened up Captain America. Here's another picture of Iron Man and a little read up on him. Uh, I'm really excited to open this up. It's got the spot varnished Avengers logo on the top, nothing on the bottom. Let's get into this. What's up, gamers? General Moo Moo here, and today we're going to be opening up the Mark 85 from the Bro Thor, Fat Thor. Endgame Thor wave, uh, and I'm super excited to be opening this up. So uh, let's get a closer look at what's in this package. Okay, so now looking at all these accessories compared to this, this, this is the Mark 50, this is the Infinity War suit, and the most recent, like, comparative to this. This came with no build a figure piece, just Iron Man. Uh, close fists and a blaster fist and um two effects pieces now this i think they've been listening to reviewers um because now there's four effects pieces which is what people have been asking for uh same amount of hands same kind of hands um and then this infinity gauntlet which i'm so excited to get into so let's open this thing up okay so, looking at this figure, I'm really liking the look. Now, let's get this Build-A-Figure piece out of the way. It's uh, Bro Thor, and it comes with an extra hand, the, uh, the Time Heist hand. Um, so that is cool. Put that over there with the other Build-A-Figure pieces we've got from this. Now, before we get into the figure, let's look at this Infinity Gauntlet. Now it held together really well in the package, but out of it, it uh, it came right apart. I would not have been able to guess that that was two separate pieces without um, looking at it. So let's put this on Professor Hulk. Okay, so uh, it's pretty easy to put it on. There's two steps. First things first, you take off the hand that's on there, the fist, then you uh, the slide the thing over and you plug the new hand in. and. There you go, and now you got an awesome Infinity Gauntlet. Pretty easy. Okay. So that, that's Professor Hulk with the Infinity Gauntlet. Awesome, awesome addition. Now let's get into the actual figure now that I've wasted all your time with that. Here we've got the hands, the pieces this comes with, and now the figure. Okay, first impressions, he's light, but he has a nice glossy coat on him. Um, you know, let's just first go into articulation. we got head pivot, yes, head swivel. We've got hardly any forward, good back, good amount of back, uh, forward, not too great, whatever. We got arm out that much, we've got uh, bicep swivel, 360 degree, double jointed elbows can go all the way up there, that's pretty good. Um, as for hands, it's got frontwards pivot, it's like a, it's a forward, backwards pivot, so nothing special, doesn't really matter. Uh, other arm, same, same thing. Leg. We go out that much, uh, which is pretty good out, I gotta say. Forward, that much, not 100% great, you know, still pretty good, 45 degrees. Back, hardly any. Um, a knee cut, I think there's a twist in this knee. Maybe not. Uh, definitely double jointed knees, pretty far back. Uh, as for the feet, frontwards is okay, not too good. Backwards, not, not really any foot movement, but ankle pivot, so. Um, that's that, that's the articulation. Uh, you know, I think we gotta get into poses before I can really form an opinion on it. 
but I do gotta say I like the look of this thing it, it you know it, it wasn't quite floating my boat like the lack of shoulders I think was the real issue for me um, but now looking at it I like it it's definitely going on the shelf before we get into the poses Let's actually, let's do a comparison here of, uh, of some of, some of his pals in Endgame. Sorry, first things first here, uh, I gotta get the sizes of these two figures. So, here's its counterpart, uh, it's about a six and a quarter, six, yeah, about six and a quarter inches. And then, he, um, the 85 is also about six and a quarter inches, so, awesome. Okay, so this is Mark 85 Iron Man, and I gotta say I hope you like what I did there, combining the uh, the measuring and the stop motion. I might be doing that more often. I don't know. I'll see how it performs. Anyway, um, this is Iron Man Mark 85. I gotta say I love it. I love the amount of effort I put into it. They put into it. I love the amount of accessories. I love the quality of the figure. I, I even loved the style of the figure, which I was not too big of a fan of when I ordered it. So, um, man, I just gotta say I'm really satisfied with the figure. Um, with the figure alone, the figure alone would get a 7. All these accessories, the whole package, man, I gotta say it deserves more than a 7. It is an 8 or 9 because holy cow, the, they, I love what they did with this. This is it's fantastic. I'm really glad I picked this one up pretty awesome um so i hope you all enjoyed if you did please click subscribe go through the playlist uh, these babies marvel legends big marvel legends opener um so please watch uh see y'all later